Okay, this video we're going to show you the various grill options you've got for your Range Rover L322 06-09 model. So this is the standard grill that was fitted to the car. Okay, and then we've got various grill options, okay? So we've got three grills we can see here. They look different size only because of the perspective, but the bottom grill is the supercharged grill. So that this was the only upgrade you could do, and this is actually the only different grill made by the factory. So this was what the supercharged grill looked like. Now this next one uses the same frame as the supercharged grill, but has this 2010 style autobiography mesh in the middle. Now the last one we've got is a new grill that's just been developed and that makes your car look like an 2014 model L405 so it actually makes it look like the new generation or at least it's obviously not going to make the whole car look like it but it just gives it a fresher cleaner more updated look um, okay so they're the grills we've got so these all fit only the 06 to 09 models and they drop straight in <clears throat> so having shown you what you can get let's show you how to do it so let me pass the camera over to Kate right so release your bonnet open up your bonnet <clears throat> excuse me and then what you've got is three bolts on this grill one two three okay so you can either do them with a cross head or an M8 socket, we've got an M8 socket and all the screws are the same so that's the deal there so put them somewhere safe ok, there's the second one there's the third one here ok, right ok, that's, that's finished with the screwdriver now, in the corners here they've got this little clip so if you just push down you can see that little clip there. Sometimes they're engaged fully, sometimes they're not. And that's the second one. And then you're ready to release the grill at the top. And as you lift, it just simply pulls forward. So if you look, you've got this, this foot at the bottom here that locates into this mount here. You've got this little T-shape here that locates into the middle section here okay and the other thing to watch here is this temperature sensor so this temperature sensor just pulls out you don't need to disconnect it okay and what you've got is you've got this this narrow slot here that goes over this thin web here so it literally you've got the rounded side and, and literally it just slides over there and pushes in so that's your air temperature sensor so just leave that dangling that's fine so there we go so if we put that there that shows you the progression of grills and fitting the new grill is is as easy as um as just just so this is the l405 look grill okay so you offer this up okay you take the temperature sensor okay push the temperature sensor in okay and then at the bottom here you want to line this little leg up here and then you've got the two bits that push through here okay and then as you go to push it forward it'll okay get the bottom feet in get the two bottom feet in okay and then you push in these top connections here okay and then put the screws back in Okay. That's it done. Okay, so just check these bits are engaged and then lower the bonnet and you can see there that's the difference that grill makes to the car.